Now, good evening. I just said I'd do a quick little video here. I'm after just feeding them now for the evening. It's Sunday evening. It's the 10th of April. And it's been brought to my attention that I never told anyone what the little calf was, the Galloway calf was. Well, he's in there somewhere, in the mix. But he's a bull. So we've got five bulls and three heifers and one cow left the calf. So there he is there. Inside, let me see, can I zoom in? There he is there now, yeah. Not getting overly excited. But uh, there you are now, a bit of life to him. So he's flying it, he's doing great. No bother to him, I, and I zoom out. Now we're back out. Yeah, so this is all the calves here now, yeah. This bio here now, I still have to say, is my favorite. And uh, that's a purebred bold calf, short horn. And then that's the little short horn now, the whitehead cow. He's starting to fill out now as well, and a nice coat on him, and a lovely color. But um, there's the last few calves there now. There's the little red short horn heifer, purebred, and then the hybrid calf. So there he is now, very happy in himself. Let me see if we get a bit closer. So a jet black and a white belt. I'm very happy with him now. So I have them in here now for the evening, they're after getting their feed now and I'll move them in the morning. We're starting to get fairly tight now on grass. It's been cold. There's not been much growth. Whatever I'm eating off is what's been grown over the winter and there's not much coming back. So, unfortunately, I'm still on the tightening phase for now. But here's a little video of our, of our cats playing about. <laughs> so yeah, uh, it's been cold, but I think it's gonna warm up now this week. Apparently it's gonna get a bit milder now from Tuesday on, so. So hopefully now we'll start getting a bit of spring grass coming on. So um, that's the situation now at the minute. All is quiet for now. Outside of waiting on this lady here to calf. If we get another look at her now. She's actually after putting up a bit more of a bag now this couple of days. So I'll be keeping a close eye on her. I still think she'll calf within the week. So what are we now? Sunday. So maybe next Sunday. She needs to calf anyhow before the 24th. Because I'm going away with the family down to Clare. So it was actually my sister that reminded me to talk about what sex this calf was. So there he is there now. They're all very happy. I'm just trying to look at his head here now. Yeah, he's definitely different looking to his sister last year. You know for a fact that he's a, a bit of a short horn in him. He's a finer looking head. Them Galloways tend to have a kind of a big, strong pole on them. They're naturally hornless, so they're naturally pollies, but they have a big forehead. That little fella there has the short horn head. He's very like his sister there, and his, his two sisters there, yeah. So, uh, so that's the story with the little calves now. <laughs> I'm going to get them home now very soon now and I'll tag them all together. And uh, and we can start thinking about uh, moving them on up the real grass. So that's the situation now at the minute. I'm doing a lot of uh, pausing in my talk because I'm just kind of fascinated with these little calves. Like ass little boys and girls. So uh, that fella's definitely coming to life now. So anyhow, that's the story now. A short little video. And a little update on where we're at. So we'll, uh, we'll leave it at that for now. But I'm going to thank my subscribers. 
We're heading for 600 now, yeah, which is which is brilliant. So if you like these videos and you want to see more of them, you should subscribe to me on the way out. Don't hit the notification bell because that's a head wreck. I don't even like getting notified myself of videos. So a subscription will do and even a now like for the crack. So that's the story and we'll talk to you very soon. Bye, bye, bye.